Hey guys, it's Katie here. It's been a while. Um, it's finally Tiger's year and I took a few days off just to rest and learn, including yesterday. But today I woke up and I was like, I need to make a video and I want to share a really awesome thing with you. Uh, well, if you're new to my channel, I'm Katie. I'm all about cosmetics, beauty and aesthetic. And this is what I do here on my channel. And today, guys, I would like to talk about this Hollywood filter, Hollywood Flawless Filter for a Superstar Youth Glow from Charlotte Tilbury. Guys, you know, first time I saw it, I was like, um, I think it's just, you know, um, a liquid highlighter. But then I saw many people using it as a base. And I was like, wow, that's interesting. I want to give it a try too. Wow, guys, I actually, I tried it two times already and I was like, oh my gosh, it does make a difference and it makes your skin look so youthful. So I was like, wow, I need to, I need to share it with you guys. So, um, yeah, I'm looking for this. Uh, I've already done my uh, eyes, eyebrows and I would lip balm. And I've used primer from Rare Beauty, um, always an optimist for diffuse, diffusing primer. Uh, you can actually use uh, this one as a primer as well, but I've tried it before and it works perfectly well. It holds throughout the day, so I decided to use it with a primer and let you know as well how it holds or is there a difference maybe it looks even better i don't know so it looks like this uh, my one in the shade two light clear but I, I don't think it really matters like if your skin is dark or fair so uh it looks like this and i usually apply that much and just spread it with my fingers as you can see guys it instantly gives you that natural like youthful healthy skin glow and I was like wow it looks so good I really like it let me take a mirror because my eyesight is super poor, so I need to see closer. Did I blend it out? Yes, I did. And that's enough. And today I will use, I use it with a cushion. It works ping, super well. And today I want to use it along with Burberry foundation. This one is one of my favorite foundations. And I want to try out first, like one part of my face, I will use fingers and the other part of my face, I will use a damn beauty blender. So let's go. I don't like to use too much. I prefer, <laughs> know to see my skin through just to make the skin tone even don't run don't forget about your neck about your ear line a little bit you can build it up under your eyes you know like to make it basically work as a concealer same nose area okay it looks like this i uh, used hands and here we go Beauty Blender. I'm not a big fan of Beauty Blenders because it picks up quite a lot of products, so you need to use more. And uh, also, I don't know, you just cannot reach out 
to places that you can with your fingers. Maybe I'm just lazy, I don't know. So as you can see, uh, the Beauty Blender side uh, looks more dewy and uh, more like a, a medium coverage and uh, hand side is more like a light coverage. I still like hand side better because it looks more natural and you can still see the glow that the Charlotte Tilbury gives you. It gives really nice glow, like literally your skin looks so fresh. Guys, but also I wonder, uh, can I use it on top as um, highlighter? Let me finish the rest of my makeup, which is powder. I always use it in the center of my face and uh, bronzer and um, blush. And I'll be back to you to try it out as a highlighter. So here we go, guys. I finished the rest of my face. I used powder, bronzer, and blush. And I want to try this one as a highlighter. Let's try it out on one side and see. Oh my gosh, I didn't remove it. Let's put lipstick on. actually looks beautiful. Can you tell? Wow guys, actually it I do not know if the camera picks it up, but I've heard some people saying that applying this as a highlighter on the higher like points of your face on the cheekbones but a little bit higher it gives you kind of like that um illusion of the fillers in your cheeks actually i can see what they were talking about it actually like you know like creates a third dimensional like lift <laughs> doesn't make sense i don't know but let me try from the other side i actually enjoying it i am Can you see the difference? <laughs> I don't know if the camera picks it up, but guys, wow, I like it. I actually didn't try it before as a highlighter itself, but actually I do like it. Let me put a little bit on the bridge of the nose. guys I do like it okay and the last step I will use my setting spray which is here from Charlotte Tilbury as well every time I do that I'm afraid I will punch myself in the face which happens sometimes <laughs> so here we go the final look and I already know that this guy lasts for a long time, as long as, as well as um, uh, Burberry foundation does. But still, let's see how it holds together. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm rambling. Okay, guys, uh, now it's almost three. It's two four thirty-five. Wow, it's two thirty-five. So see you later in the day. Hey guys, I update. So, <laughs> shit update. So now it's almost whatever five, and it's been three hours. So you can see both sides. Oh, it's actually red. Both sides look super good and natural. And 
it's still you can still see that natural glow that Charlotte Tilbury filter gives you lovely I actually like both sides really really nice so guys it's nine o'clock now and it's been over six hours now and as you can tell now I'm using the light for sure um, the skin looks dewy but actually it looks really well still and uh, let's I use usually do I touch up with the powder to see if I can touch it up will it look good or not I'm using my one from by Tari. yep and it works as well basically Yeah, I'm looking as if I've just applied it. So yeah, guys, Charlotte Tilbury filter. Where is it? I'm holding it here. Hollywood Flawless filter is perfect for those ones who want a little bit of a like glowier, uh, healthier skin. This one is perfect and it's really long lasting. It works as a primer and as you can tell, it also works with primer. And over this one, you can use um, any foundation or cushion. You can use your fingers or you can use um, sponge, um, damn beauty blender for a medium coverage and a more healthier, gl not healthier, glowier finish. And it also can be used as a highlighter as well. So guys, this one, I highly recommend to try this one out. This one is super, super nice. And that was it. Thank you so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.